Keep things moving. Everybody give, a, give it up for Mr. Joe Mez. Greetings, how y'all doing this evening, Money Plays? First, let's give it up for all the artists and uh, spoken word people that uh, was on this evening. They're fucking awesome so far. All right, well, I'm gonna do something different than I usually do. So, you know, uh, who here has actually used uh, online dating in the past? Yeah. yeah. Actually, so have I at one point. Now, who has actually found their mate or someone on uh, Facebook? Anybody? Wow, crickets. Okay, well, I've actually found my current victim, you ready for this? On MySpace. <laughs> who remembers MySpace? Okay, now we know who, you, who used to use it, who still uses it? That's what I thought. <laughs> well, I met my current victim on MySpace. You know, at the time when I first moved to Vegas, I was actually, truth be told, I was actually looking for a girlfriend. I was actually trolling for one. I, f I found, uh, I met my, uh, met my wife online, and we talked for a bit. Then we just stopped talking for a little bit. Then all of a sudden I get a notice that she needed, needed to help her with a virus on her computer. That's what I do for a living. So I came over. She led a complete stranger in her house. <laughs> so, I end up fixing her computer. Then she asked, well, how much? She said, let's just go get some coffee. After having some coffee for a bit, we found out we used to live in the same city together. We knew the same people. And she worked at the store that I used to go to all the time. The same Denny's. So, we ended up hanging out with each other for a good long time. So, um, then... About nine months into the relationship, we found out that Becca cannot do math right. She said everything was okay, and about a couple months later, well, we found out we're having a kid. It's fine, we're still together. We still are, we still love each other, we don't have fight that much, so it's all good. So it's just really funny how two people meet in a different city that used to live in the same city, and actually know the same people. We're, to this day, we're still finding out that we know each other from other places. We met each other like when we were 12. <laughs> so, who knows in this world? Small fucking world. All right, um, me, I'm, sometimes I'm an ass. Okay, I'm a fucking asshole sometimes. I like fucking with people, because I've come to realize people hear, but they don't listen. They hear what you're saying, but they're sitting there talking on their phone. Yeah? Oh, yeah, well, that's interesting. Oh, really? Fuck you. Hey, put down your phone. And here, let's carry on a conversation. Before the phones existed. Dumbass. Well, I, you know, I realize this thing that, that people hear, but they don't listen. I was fixing this lady's computer a couple years ago, and she was ranting on raving how much she loved her internet access. After a little... Uh, controlling the conversation, I ended up getting this old lady, about 60, 70 years old, to actually say with a straight face, I love cocks. She didn't realize what she said. I'm just sitting there, <coughs> uh, but not out loud. Uh, just controlling people's uh, people here, but they don't listen. Like you can say, fuck you, have a good day. Oh, you too. <laughs> Try it. It works. Well, my favorite one is when someone sees, sneezes, I say, I bless you. When they say, thank you, you're welcome. It just gives me you know, a little more of a God complex. I happen to like that sometimes. Need an ego boost every so often. <laughs> what else was I gonna talk about? I completely forgot. Ah, yes. One? Okay. Well, for those who don't know, I was actually in the Navy. Actually, I was in the Navy. I was in the Navy for four years, four months, eight days, and 17 hours. No, I wasn't counting. Okay, I'm lying, I was. But I, I realized Navy is an acronym. It actually stands for something. It stands for never again volunteer yourself. Never again. Be smart, don't start. You know, uh, and well, one of the first knots I learned when I got to the ship was a hangman's noose. 
I should have seen that how my Navy career was going to end up. Yeah. Um, hey, but I realized that if you uh, 13 raps is illegal, 12 isn't, 14 isn't. But hey, something new. Now you learned something today. <laughs> so I can't think of anything else. So uh, <clears throat> I will do a voice. How about that? Hey, Mr. Murgatroyd, my time is up. Exit stage right. All right, well, y'all have a good evening. I'm Joe Mez. Be safe.